Hello, people! Have you noticed how kids of famous footballers look like their fathers? Leo Messi and Thiago Messi, also Chiro and Matteo, Ronaldo Sr. and Ronaldo Jr., Marcelo and Anto, Neymar and Davi Luca. Just look at them, they are identical. Of course, we are joking, the truth is, they are completely different. The only similar thing they have are blue eyes and their desire to dive. Today I'm gonna tell you how that happened, why doesn't Davi look like Ney, who are his parents and who is that kid. There are a lot of videos about Ronaldo and Messi's kids, but none about his blondie. That's unfair! Guys, before the start of this video, press like, subscribe and ring the bell. Plus, write in the comments below who is your football idol, it is very interesting to know. Ready? Let's go! Ney and Davi, you can't say they are relatives from the first sight. Well, actually, no one said that. It's definitely his son, but not quite definitely. Neymar played football with his son, and before that, his wife played with a neighbor. We are kidding, by the way. Answering all the questions. It's definitely his son. The neighbor didn't do anything, and if he did, Ney could easily find out about that. Come on, a DNA test costs about 500 bucks. I think he can pay for it. But there is no need in it. And you know why? A long time ago, he had an affair with Carolina Dantas, his girlfriend from school. In 2011, when the Brazilian was playing for Santos and was already preparing to move to Europe, Carolina gave birth to a boy. At that time, a 19-year-old footballer was on cloud 9. As for Davis' appearance, that's how he looked like. And here's his mother, Carolina Dantas. One more time. That's him. And that's his mother. Any questions? Yes, a mulatto and a pale-skinned girl have a white child, that can happen. Even two mulattoes can have a pale-skinned child. All in all, yes, Davy looks like mommy. By the way, the couple broke up after two months since the baby's birth, probably because of different tempers. Neymar doesn't tell a whole lot about the relationships they have today. Although Carolina had something to say. We don't contact too much, text each other when it comes to our son, I don't care about his personal life. Neymar is a big boy now. The only thing that we have in common is Davi. All in all, if they loved each other before, there's nothing left now. He has his own life, she has her own. Carolina lives in Brazil, sews cloths and raises son from another man. And Neymar plays in Paris, having pictures with his new girlfriend Natalia Barulic for GQ magazine, pretending that everything is alright with his career after leaving Barcelona. Most of the time Davy spends with his father in Paris, however, he visits his mother quite often. If you can fly every week there and back here on a private plane, why not to take that opportunity? No wonder that Ney's son spends most of the time in the capital of France. There are a lot more entertainments there. Neymar takes Davy to press conferences, PSG VIP lounge, meets him with Paris elite at different parties. Neymar barely talks about his son with press. Of course, because it's not the talks about getting back to Barcelona. But one interesting fact about Davy, Ney said, Davy loves Kylian Mbappe. When I took him on a training, he talked about Kylian all the time in the car. He begged me to introduce him to Kylian. At the end, I made his dream come true and he settled down. I guess at that moment he was the happiest kid on the planet. Well, when I was a kid, I wanted to meet someone from the Ninja Turtles. I liked Leonardo the most. All in all, Davy lives a life of an average 8-year-old child. Not to mention that his father is extremely rich. Sometimes he plays football, studies, enjoys his life-heartedness and has an Instagram page with 1.3 million followers. That is all for today. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, press like, it's the best gratitude for us. Subscribe and watch attached videos. Inside football, we watch football from a different angle. Bye-bye!